kete Hizi sita Kata bika ili nwe na wewe te This is the beautiful Stone Town in Zanzibar. Stone Town is the old part of Zanzibar city in Tanzania, and it's located on the western coast of Unguja, the main island of Zanzibar. It was built around a really old fishing village, and you can tell by all the molds on the wall. It's right on the water, and it was named for the coral stone buildings that were built during the 19th century. There are about 15, 16,000 people that live in this town. And here our tour guide is showing us a core stone building. And here is my friend Andrew photobombing. So this footage I promise you does not represent this town justly. The architecture is gorgeous here and it's right on the ocean so the weather is beautiful most of the time. There are different religious and cultural groups that coexist peacefully in Stone Town and that is what's so unique and beautiful about this place. You'll find people of Arab descent, Indian descent, African descent living together. You'll find churches and mosques built parallel to one another. However, I did notice that the culture is mainly Islamically influenced and perhaps because of the historical context of this place. He was trying to explain to us that coral stone buildings are all over this town. And here are a bunch of teens named boys hitting on my friend Jess. How adorable. Alright, so we continued walking throughout the town. It's relatively small. You could probably walk beginning to end in about an hour. Um, it's very peaceful, very quiet. Maybe because it was 9 in the morning and people were still sleeping? I don't know. Uh, but people are very friendly here. And that child? He doesn't even know him. <laughs> it's really adorable. Do you hear that cat noise? That's our tour guy. He was a goofball. I love that man. If I were to go back to Zanzibar, he is definitely the man to go to. This is a health clinic in the center of the town and we are heading right now to a primary school. I believe it is the only primary school in this place. Um, the fact that it's very small, it is understandable. That is perfectly normal. All right, now you are going to view something very, very beautiful. What he was trying to show us is you will see a mosque and a church right next to each other. Does anyone see like? This is a great representation of what this town stands for. All right, and we finally arrived to the primary school that is found in the heart of Stone Town. This place is so creative and so colorful and beautiful. Oh, hey there, pretty lady. That is my friend Lorraine, by the way. And I believe this school is private because the primary language here is English, and a lot of children did speak English, so. I just assumed it was private, um, but I wasn't sure if there were nearby schools also. And you can see here that it's all in English. 
We did arrive right before lunchtime, so a lot of children were being uh, dismissed to go have lunch outside, and they are just so adorable. Mm, nom, 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 nom. She's so cute. Anyway, this was the classroom that we shortly volunteered in right after lunch break was over. And meanwhile, we headed outside where all the food vendors were. There was so much goodies everywhere. We did not have lunch, however. Okay, I kind of had lunch, but that is off the record. Those are sliced mangoes, and they are delicious. Unfortunately, our trip did come to an end right around here. And next, we headed to a spice farm uh, where this really awesome man climbed the coconut tree, I mean, with style. <laughs> Can you say America Got Talent? His voice is heavenly. And later, we had coconut juice, and it was delicious. Then we visited the Sultan Palace that was built in the early 19th century. There is a link down below to all the pictures I took. I did not do such a wonderful job documenting this trip, and I'm really sorry about that. Um, but, I mean, it's a good thing, right? I was really busy actually enjoying myself, but in retrospect, I probably should have done a better job. Anyway, next time I travel, inshallah, I will be well prepared and I hope you enjoyed this very brief tour around Stonetown and the amazing singing coconut man. And uh, inshallah, I'll get to see you guys soon. So, Kwahiri! <laughs> Sito kuangalia kusoni, kitu mia viva ya pesa hizoni Sa kutunza hizoni, kenda mwano ngeza faida kulikoni Ona nalia, tunza pesa kati mimi sipo Oh why, oh why, tunza pesa kati mimi nipo